Hello everyone and welcome to Set 5 Let's Play Minecraft Story Mode. Now, um, in between last set and this set, I discovered, or they, um, uh, Mojang or whoever does the releasing now, actually released it, released a skin pack for this game, which I, I was complaining a while ago that, you know, they didn't do that. It, it didn't make much sense, but apparently they did, so, awesome. Anyway, um, uh, <laughs> episode 5, order up. Now, this is the last episode I have ever seen a Let's Player do. It's the most recent episode. And after this episode, I'm not going to watch any more uh, Let's Plays on this. So, pretty much everything after this is going to be uh, blind for me. So, <laughs> let's get to it. Oh, shiny! Alright, let's go! Ah, crap. I had my hand away from the controller when I was, uh... <laughs> um, doing shit. Alright. That is a powerful fucking sword! Come on, and... Struck all you! Wish my diamond sword did that. Hey, Pira! Oh, she has enchanted iron sword! Petra! Nope! Hello, Jonathan Stoward. Ooh, arrows! Nice! And hop over. <laughs> I'm a badass. Dude, you're getting pretty good at this. Yeah, I am. You guys are working way too hard. <laughs> oh gods. Hey, work smart, not hard. Where I guess this was a good tip. Well, Jesse. So, are we doing this? Order of the Stone. Let's get some treasure. Treasure. Hmm. Interesting. So much for treasure. This cupboard is bare. Come on, you know how these places work. The treasure's never just out in the open. Let's fan out and search the place. Sounds good to me. Alright. What's this? Huh. These channels lead to the center of the room. <clears throat> they look like they're designed to let lava flow from those channels in the wall. Why would you want to do that? To do stuff? Alright, what do we got here? Lava flow. Let's see here. I think I do the two sides and then the middle. I think that's how it's solved. If memory serves, let's find out. Nope. Again. All right. Okay, so it's uh, I'm assuming it's going to be these walls. The uh. Quartz is going to solve it. So one. Let's go over here. Let's talk to Petra. Hi, Petra. This place is cool. Knew you'd find it. 
So, how are you feeling lately? Wither sickness free. I think. Now I'm just trying to get used to having teammates and people who worry about me. That's pretty new for me. It's nice though. Yeah. Any thoughts on this place? I think I'd rather be in a straight fight than doing all this switch pulling stuff. But I'm glad Ivor's intel about this place was good. Okay. I'm going to keep trying to solve this. Alright then. That was nice. Alright. So this would be two. Goes off that one. But keeps you active. So let's reactivate this. Since that's a three right there. Pretty simple puzzle if that's, if that's the case. Yep, somewhere. seems to be that's the case. Yeah, pretty simple puzzle. They put the answer right on the wall. And then four. Run to the lever! And there we go! <laughs> that's actually really cool. Disappointed if the floor didn't open up into a dark, creepy passageway. I know, right? This kind of reminds me of when we first found the Order's Temple. We were such a scared bunch of noobs back then. Hey, I wasn't scared. <laughs> yeah, we were all totally unprepared. Crazy we didn't die. And to think that was just the beginning. Yeah. That was before we fought weirder storms, hung out with Enderman, reunited the Order. So crazy. I like my armor. It's really cool. Bingo! What have we here? Alright, let's see what we got. Alright, let's open the far back one. Yeah. Man, this reminds me of that time when you got a cake from that witch's hut, and I was super jealous of you. It's just, I really love cake. Hey, if you want it, it's all you. Oh man! Oh man! Oh man! Thank you. Hmm, a pumpkin. Not bad. Huh? I suppose that could be useful if we run into Enderman. And looks like we've got one more thing in here. It's. You find? What are you guys talking about? Whoa, that's super cool. I've never seen flint and steel like that before. I'll be honest with you, Olivia. I have no idea what this is or what it does. Uh, I do. A burning stuff, right? I mean, but it must do something besides that, right? You could give it a shot and find out. Okay, flint and steel, do your thing. Awesome. And strike. Never seen a flint and steel do that before. Uh oh. God damn, it's Walking Dead all over again. I've just started re recently watching it. Just finished season one. Uh oh. Looks like some monsters have a death wish. Yeah. Yeah, it's me. Seems like a good time for a secret handshake. Yeah. Huh. Use the redstone wrap. Obviously. Uh, I think you mean the warrior whip. Let's go with that. Go! Nice! I approve. You guys, that was amazing! Okay, okay. It wasn't bad. I really approve that. Zabbies! Oh no! Or! The chair to bow even? Nice! Nice. Really wish we could do this in the actual game. Yep, red bitches. Look out. Slide. 
You know, a son of a cat wouldn't be that hard in Minecraft. All I have to do is sprint and crouch. We're trapped. Now what? Quick, jump! Get it! Land the vines. Hello. Crap, cave spiders. Spiders. Why did it have to be cave spiders? The only way out of here is through them. So get ready. Got it. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. That was easy. Axel has a point, that was pretty sweet. This is becoming like my lucky sword. Oh no. Give me my sword! Come on, dude, let's get you out of here. Nice. I tell you guys, doing that never gets old. Woo! Yeah, not too bad. Killing a bunch of monsters, getting sweet treasure. Like that flint and steel thing? You gotta try it again. I'd be curious to see it again, too. I'm dying to know how it works. I'm way ahead of you on that one, Axel. Whoa! Well, well. Where'd you get the new toy? <laughs> Looks a little, uh, sophisticated for you, Jesse. Order of the losers. Yeah, losers. Ugh, who let you guys out of your cave? Joke's on you, we don't live in a cave. Shut up, you idiots! Uh, what grief are you here to give us now? Look who's talking! So what are you ocelots doing here, anyway? The ocelots were Lucas's gang. We ditched that name just like we ditched him. Yeah, we rebranded. We're the Blaze Rods now. Blaze Rods! Shut up, Gil. Sorry, boss. Huh. Pretty cool name. Of course it is. And I don't give a crap about what you think. And where's Lucas, huh? The minute the Order decided you were cool... For whatever reason... ...you wouldn't stop sniffing around you like a tame dog. You take that back! Mmm, no. Hey, Lucas is ten times the guy you are. Or he's a whiny dingus. Petra, just ignore it. They don't know what they're talking about. Lucas is our friend, Jesse. No one talks about our friends like that. You probably think that thing makes you so special. Classic Jesse. You take all the best stuff and never give anyone else a chance. That should have been ours. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Money's raw. Oh, come on. That's not fair, Aiden. We're adventuring just like anyone else. <laughs> well, that's, that's just what I expect from someone as small-minded as you, Jesse. Hand over the flint and steel, Jesse. Don't make me ask again. You don't get that one. It's supposed to be mine. Just go find your own stuff, Aiden. It's not enough that you gotta save the world. You had to go and take all the world's best stuff, too. So, if I want my own stuff, that means I need to take it from you. I'm tired of listening to your jaw flap. Ah! You don't touch me. Some hero you are, Jesse. Let's just go home, you guys. These blazed rods aren't worth it. Fine. What hope do we have when heroes like you are throwing your weight around like this? It's not always going to be this way, though. Come on, you guys. Let's get out of here. Blaze Rod! Ooh, I told you to shut up! Look out, Jesse. I don't remember him being that angry before. Wow. Us being the New Order of the Stone is really getting to that guy. He's gone crazy. We should be careful. He seems different. Scarier. Man. And all because he wanted that flint and steel. 
What are you gonna do with it? Ivor's the one that told us about this temple. He might know something about it. Hopefully Ivor can tell us more about it. Wow, they are really stupid. Although I do love that guy just going blaze rods. And I love the fact that um uh He's starting to recognize <laughs> stuff again. Feels just a uh, brawler type. To that, friend. I just can't shake what Aiden was saying about us back there. We do get a lot of treasure. And I guess sometimes we might throw our weight around. What? No. Aiden's got a bad case of treasure envy, pure and simple. I don't know. Come on, Aiden's just jealous. Isn't that obvious? He sees us with our fancy armor, cool treasure, and he wishes he had it too. I guess so. Well, no matter what Aiden thinks, there's one thing I know. What's that? They think we're awesome. They're back! You guys, they're back! Run! Tell everyone that our heroes have returned! Jeez, calm down! Fuck! Yeah, new order of the stone is back in town. <laughs> this is so weird. That was funny. High five. See that? Jesse high five me. Me. It actually hurt a little bit. Wow. Yes, let's be fans. That's awesome. That wasn't happy to see us scream. Wow, that's new. It somehow manages to evoke skulls. And tentacles. Wow, that is one epic build. With the lava? Yeah, yeah, and the skull motif? Awesome! I will never understand your taste. Not my fault! Look out! Oh, uh, help! Oh, stop your whining. What are your pathetic injuries in comparison to my majestic tower? Ivor? <sighs> of course. Oh, Jesse, you're back! Don't listen to a word these fools tell you. It's a fire hazard! And your face is an ugly hazard. So I suppose we're even. Man, Ivor, this is really cool. Why, thank you, Jesse. So good to finally see someone with some vision. Jesse, seriously? You can't let him keep this up. Jesse, all I wanted was what any man wants. A little house of my own, with loads of lava pouring off it. Ivor, I know you mean well, but your house wants to kill people. Dude, you made a killer house. Exactly! Killer! What about just moving it someplace else? I'm sure that- Move it? Way more lava is going to spill out if we do that. Well, we have to tear it down. We can't let that monstrosity stand. <laughs> It's my house, Jesse. I have just as much a right to build something as all these people, don't I? They're just jealous that I've got vision. Mm. Well, they've got... They've got... Community planning. Blech! Let's leave it alone. I like it. Ivor obviously put a lot of work into his new house, and we need to show it the same respect that we would show a house not dripping with lava. Leave it. I'm sure we can find a way to work around it, okay? Not with my lava house. Long live lava! Thanks, Jesse! That's right. Keep walking. Keep walking! Always nice to see a gracious winner. I know, right? Ha uh ha. -huh. Haven't seen you around in a while. So what can I do for you, Jesse? Ivor! We found something at that temple you told us about. What? You did? <laughs> yes! Great to see you again! Let's do lunch! I'll bring the carrots! There's no telling who's listening. Meet me in the treasure room. Ten minutes. And bring the thing you found! Calm your tits, jeez! 
If we're going to keep that thing up, we should at least encase the lava in some glass to make it safer. But, like, not too safe. Come on, help me collect some sand. I agree with Olivia. Make sure that when we bake it into glass, it's the right amount of safe. Okay. We'll catch up with you later. Yeah, once we make sure this art gets the respect it deserves. Right, what he said. Nice work today, guys. Yeah, not bad, right? Mm, it's like we should do this more often or something. Later, guys. Come on, let's go find Ivor. The lava actually is uh, away from anything really burnable. So it's, it should be safe, quote unquote. Wow, a sponge. This place is really shaping up. Oh, hey guys. You have some pretty cool stuff in here. Crazy stuff. Hey, Lucas. Great to see you. It's been a while. I really missed you guys. We missed you too. We have so many other treasures. Boy, you've sure been busy. Oh, wow. You framed it. I'm him. Yeah. How are you doing? I still feel guilty about it. Every time I see another pig, all I can think about is how Lupin died because I put him in danger. He didn't die in some accident, Jesse. He sacrificed himself. He was a hero. Yeah. Doesn't make me feel any less guilty, though. <sighs> okay, guys. I promise I wasn't just here to bum everybody out. I actually came back because I need to tell you something. It's about this weird run-in I had with Aiden. Oh, I hate that guy. Whatever you said or did, it really got to him. Uh-huh, we saw him too. The Order of the Stone and the Blaze Rods are just as friendly as ever. That's an understatement. He's just been so jealous of you and the rest of the Order ever since you saved the world from the Witherstorm. He's convinced that he was supposed to be a hero. Ever since he took over the Ocelot and the blaze rods it just seems like he's gotten meaner he's pushing Maya and Gil around jealous why he thinks you're a big bully Jesse looting and keeping all the good stuff for yourself so what'd you find that got Aiden so excited anyway check it out wow what a weird glow yeah I know I'm supposed to show it to you. found it! No! Whoa! Dude! What is wrong with you? This is the greatest find of our time. I can't believe you're actually... That you're actually holding this. Okay, Phil. What's it do? It proves what I've always suspected. That glow. That enchantment is the work of a very old group of builders. A group so old that they existed even before the Order of the Stone. Whoa. Yeah. Dramatic. So? What's the flint and steel do then? Uh, not 100% sure, actually. But I suspect that it's related to the exciting part. You see, if these builders truly existed, and if you found their temple, that means we're one step closer to finding the Eversource. What a beautiful sight. Looks like you came back just in time, Lucas. Did you just make that up? No. I found books, mysterious tomes, referencing it on my travels. Mysterious tomes, huh? The Eversource is said to be an object of incredible power possessed by the old builders. It was some sort of treasure or artifact that gave them an endless supply of precious materials. Think about it, Jesse. That temple must have been its hiding place. Wow. Old builders? You learn something new every day. I'm still just trying to wrap my head around the Eversource. Well... What are we waiting for, then? We've already been to that temple once. Finding it again will be a snap. Old builders, ever sources, ancient mysteries. You know I'm in. Excellent! I'll pack my adventuring things immediately. Wait, he's coming? Wow, sounds like you guys have a lot to get to. I, uh, guess I'll take off? Nope, you're coming with. I need a buffer between me and Ivor. Let's get moving.
<laughs> Interesting. I do like that chandelier, though. I think I may recreate that in one of my houses. That's a lot. Aww. Uh, adventure. Lucas, I know it's daytime, but watch our backs, okay? I can't believe we're bringing Ivor with us. I mean, it's nice that he's so excited, but ugh, not my top choice for adventuring companion. Uh, come on. He's super funny. And he makes me laugh. I guess. These trees are enormous! I love it so much! It just really gets on my nerves sometimes. Remarkable. Look at this architecture. So old. So exquisite. Oh, this is just how I dreamed it would be. Hey, let's not get all enamored with the architecture now. We've got a treasure to find. Wow. It looks so different during the day. Okay, but careful what you touch. There could be traps everywhere. Petra, blonde guy, are you so as excited as I am? Blonde guy! I'm not sure that's possible. Yeah, yeah. Huh. Doesn't look like those lava channels work anymore. Well, that's annoying. Yeah, should I flip the switch again? Nope, we broke it. Lovely. Hey, you doing? I can't believe we missed some sort of secret area here last night. Uh, we were kind of fighting, oh, a ton of monsters. It's not surprising that we didn't hit every single nook and cranny. Fair point, fair point. Alright, where is it? There it is. That wasn't there last night. Yeah, another creeper hit it. That looks promising. I'm heading up. Fantastic. We'll follow right behind you. Uh, yeah. What he said. It's nice to see that he's not, you know, psychotically crazy anymore. So you think this Eversource thing is up here? Nah. Who would? Hard to say, Jesse. Goes, the old builders feared its potential, Hi. so they hid it away in a place where it would never be found. And ha! It never has been! Hmm. What is Jesse doing up there? I'm looking at shit, shut up! Well, that looks promising. And step! Jesse! What do you see? <gasps> Some kind of portal? It's just as I'd imagined. Spectacular. That's a weird looking portal. Have you seen anything like it before? No. The old builders experimented with portals, but this is different from anything I've seen. Here goes nothing. Uh, so before I lie, I'm gonna say something quickly. I'm gonna pause this too, just in case something happens. Um, I had a really interesting idea for a uh, possible future update for the console versions, at least. What if you could build all these portals and have it connect to one of your friends' uh, worlds, and you can go through them? That's kind of cool. Nice. Ah, shit. Oh. Thanks for bringing this back to me, Jesse. I knew you were good for something. That thing is way bigger and more powerful than you could understand, Aiden. Give it back! Says the person who just got knocked trying to light it. Step aside, Jesse. We're heading through that portal now. Oh, no way! Aiden, you're done. This is where it ends. Fine. Blaze rods! Clear me a path. Ugh, dumbass. Nope. Nope. Sorry, Blaze Rods, dude. Ow. Let's go. We've got to follow them. If they get the Eversource, who knows what trouble they'll cause? Should we go back for Axel and Olivia? There's no time, Jesse. Can't let Aiden get the Eversource first. 
I don't usually like agreeing with Ivor, but he's got a point. Who knows what kind of trouble Aiden could be causing in there? Fair point. Yeah, I guess you're right. Now, seriously, it'd be kind of cool to have portals that can go between uh, worlds or even different save files. Whoa, whoa, whoa! I gotcha! Don't worry! I've got you! And drop him. You are surprisingly heavy. I am. The proportionate weight for my height. Thank you very much! There you go. Easy now. Yes, thank you, thank you! Okay, there's nothing but sky down there. It's all just. Empty sky. I've traveled all over our world, to nearly every corner. And there has always been land or water beneath me. You can just fall forever. And ever. And ever. What? So very strange. That right there, big floating island on the horizon. Oh, wow. I'm really surprised I didn't notice that sooner. The city in the clouds. It almost sounds impossible. I just don't know how we're going to reach it. Yeah, that's definitely going to be a problem. I can't believe this. We fall through a portal into another world and then we can't even go anywhere. Okay, people, you know the drill. What did you guys bring with you? That's my private business. Didn't exactly bring a whole lot. Why? Because we're building a bridge, and it'll take everything we have. I don't know. Seems like a long way. Do we have enough blocks? I mean, it's really, really far. Yes, that's very astute, Lucas. This island is definitely big enough. Really? Yeah. If we dig up this entire island, we should have enough to get us over there. I love this part so much. Just mind all that? I'm pushing. I'm pushing. Lucas is pushing. I'm just trying to keep away from the edge. It's all edge. Okay, gang. I think that should do it. Let's make ourselves a bridge. Excellent. This guy reminds me so much of um uh the builder guy. Just watch Ivor. <laughs> okay, this is our stop. I love it. Everybody off. Ivor. Seriously? <laughs> Sorry. Can't help myself. You're building. I. You. I, I. I don't. Hey there. Love what you did with your town. Yeah, it's very flashy. You helped build it? Y you, you. You. You were building. Uh, unauthorized building is against the law. Wait, there's a law saying people can't build? Yes, it's forbidden. This, this makes no sense. No sense. Oh, jeez, I'm sorry. We had no idea. It's a stupid law. Oh, jeez. First those other outsiders, now you. Other outsiders? Where are uh, they? Uh, uh, they went to the inn. I I'm sorry, but that's all I know. Wait, 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 I'm come back. Really sorry. And he's gone. <sighs> I wonder if everyone here is that nervous. Wow. Incredible. Wow. That is absolutely beautiful. Yes. Clearly, the Eversource is capable of miraculous things. And when I get my hands on it... Hey, how about you take a massive chill pill and we find it first? Yes, 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 yes! I'm just getting excited. And as crazy as Aiden's been lately, if he gets that thing, it would be bad. Well, if we beat him to it, he won't be able to get his slimy little hands on the thing. I'm starting to think that maybe we should try and keep a low profile while we look for the inn. These people seem pretty suspicious of us. Agreed. I really like this place. God damn it, Ivor. What's this? Boy, 
These are some popular crafting tables. Don't worry, everyone. Your turn will come in time. Please have your materials ready when you approach the crafting table. Huh? I knew I shouldn't have waited so long to eat. Mm hmm. What's wrong with him? This is a long line just to use a crafting table. You're telling me? I'm so hungry I could practically eat my wheat right here. But I won't. I'll be patient and turn it into delicious bread instead. What, uh, what can I do for you? I heard you guys have an inn somewhere around here. Where is it? Oh, uh, Milo's place? <laughs> that guy's hilarious. He's over that away. Dungeon! Milo, huh? Thanks. No problem. I'm trying to keep uh keep up with the rules, you know. Don't tell don't let on people that uh we that we craft daily. Apparently it's against the law. Don't wanna do that. It's a furnace. Good dog! Hey there. Are you on a schedule for the furnace this afternoon? Didn't think there were any more appointments today. Hang on. Let me see here. Jail, ten stone blocks. Oh yes, that went very well. Melissa, three cooked pork chops. She rescheduled. Classic Mel. Uh, no appointment for me. Thanks. I'm actually looking for the inn. Milo's place, right? It's back there. Just making sure. Right. Milo. Thanks. What's this? I saw Steve up there. Look at. No building, no crafting, no brewing, no forging unless with express permission from the founder. All complaints must be registered in person. That's it. You can stop writing now. Intense. Yeah. Hey, then, Petra. Hey, Petra. What you looking at? Just admiring the sights, actually. This place is so cool. I'm not usually one for, like, checking out people's builds or whatever, but even I have to admit, this is really impressive. Agreed. I like it. I like it a lot. Fuck are you? What's going on? Captain Reginald, at your service. Hey, so what are you guys up to? Ah, just supervising this citizen while she does her build. The founder finally approved my petition. The founder? Well, that's her palace up there. She is the keeper of the Eversource. Builds everything you see. Some days I can't even fathom how she keeps it all straight. She's. Incredible. I'm a... <laughs> I'm a fan. Aww. She builds everything? Yeah, well, it sure is amazing. <laughs> That's why she gets to make the calls about what does or doesn't get built. Like my build. It's no easy feat to get all these oak blocks. Your petition is very well handled. Oh, gosh. That's nice of you. Man, that sounds like a tough way to live life. I suppose. It's the way it's always been, though. Hmm. Hi. Uh, hello. Do you need help with that? What? No! I mean, this was authorized as a solo build. No unauthorized build partners. Okay! Hi there. I really can't talk anymore. I only have one chance at this, and I really, really don't want to screw it up. Uh, okay, kind of curious what she's making there, but okay. What the fuck? Who are you? I'm gonna talk to you. What is that? Sorry, stranger. Can't come up here. Okay, sure. Well, here's the inn. And where should I put them? Yes, just keep them here. I'll deal with them. Get out of here. Go, go! Uh, why, hello there. What can I do for you? I'm not sure what the custom is where you come from, but uh, here, <laughs> it is considered impolite to stare. Uh, hi. Sorry to bother you. Are you Milo? Yes. Yes, that's me. It's a pleasure to meet you. Uh, don't see many new arrivals here in Sky City. Now, what can I do for you, friend? I'm busy, but I can spare a moment for a friendly stranger. But, uh, <clears throat> not too many moments. <laughs> What did you need? I heard you talked to the blaze rods earlier. What did they want? Hmm. Hmm. Blaze rods. Hmm. I... I don't know any blaze rods. 
You must have been misled. I'm sorry, but it's like I told those other outsiders. I can't help you. Now, please. Hey, is this our guy? He tell you where to find the blaze rods? How many of you are there? I told you, I don't know anything. He hasn't told you anything yet? Is he hiding them somewhere?